Thank you, Derek. Wonderful. During tough times, it's always important to remain sane. And I will say that in an FTMS community service is very much the website of what we do around where our centers are. Community service is very much part of our 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 focus. Uh, Personally, in Singapore, I've been privileged to be part of community service, being there, and whatever the challenges, always there to serve. Whether in education, welfare, social, we've been there. We've also been there in football. I don't mean. Where everybody shies to go in, we go there. And I think that I'm very proud. I'm very proud that in Balasek Khalsa Football Club, I have got two anchor men supporting me, JJ and Tawa. Always there, always supportive, not only football, but personal life and business life. I really appreciate your, your mentoring and your support. By the way, Balasek Khalsa is not doing too badly this year because of our 25th anniversary. Thank you. We are joined third, I believe, today. Our learning environment has been developed from a focused approach based bear on our core values, which Radha alluded to earlier. Very simply, every element of every part of what we do, we believe that honesty, respect, integrity, trust, trust ethics, and professionalism must be there, must be in every element of work we do. And we inculcate this amongst our students so that not only we develop a we, we have graduates, but enable our graduates to develop their professional and personal lives. Our students, you see later, some of them are from, in all our centers, we counted there more than 50 nationalities. The diversity, the culture, and the vibrant city centre campuses we have help us evolve and innovate. For me and my colleagues, it has been a pleasure to have been involved in the education industry. We feel not only it's important, but it's noble as well. The passion that everyone has will ensure FTMS will be able to celebrate many more anniversaries. I would like to take the opportunity to thank many friends who have supported me, especially during our challenges that around 2005, 2006, who has helped us to where we are. To every student, one of the values we project is family. I'm very thankful for my parents who have been, who brought me up. I wish they were here to celebrate this occasion with me. Another person I would like to thank very much is Dr. Late Dr. Abdullah, our FTM Malaysia Chairman, who, whenever I was, we did business in Malaysia, 
when I say A, he says, well, haven't we done that before? Let's, let's do it. it. You know, he's always there and always with me, pushing and pushing and pushing. And he managed to break bound, boundary after boundary in Malaysia. Dato, we are here for you. My colleagues, especially my, my country managers, Saji Lam, it be wonderful in Malaysia, especially, I know the tough times, <laughs> 205 onwards. Saji and his team is wonderful in Malaysia, you see later what we've done in Malaysia, and he's been very much center of every action we took there. Ha, thank you. Vietnam, flying the flag in Vietnam into China now. Flora, Hong Kong, keeping it steady, keeping it there. Rada, who, has, who, who is very young in FTMS, but his, his work, his guts out, not only for tonight, but over the last one year or so, getting himself involved in the FTMS way. Thank you, Rada, and your team who really did a good job today. Um, I would say the number of meetings they held was incredible, and the effort they had, they deserved. Rana, Kasturi, Pash, Pushpa, the Kuan and on. Fantastic today's event. All the cross of the today. I also like to thank Surgeon, my wife, and some supporters on the left hand side. Uh, and my children. Family is always important. I said, there's always, with, uh, with family, wife, you have a 2S thing. Ignore the scolding, but very importantly, the other S, the support that I received from surgeon throughout my years. It's been fantastic. Thank you. We at FTMS Global look forward to the continued support of each and every one of you. Let's all sit back, relax, and enjoy the wonderful spirit in which we are here and the wonderful event put forward by Team FTMS Global. Thank you. Thank you very much, the CEO of FTMS Global. Thank you. Thank you so much for those very encouraging words. And with that, right now, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to invite our guest of honor onto stage. Please welcome Professor Andrew Chambers. Dating Kari, Professor Ho Peng Ki, Mr. and Mrs. Barbara Singh Mangat, Mr. and Mrs. Kaka Singh, distinguished guests, FTMS alumni, FTMS students, ladies and gentlemen. It is a real great privilege for me to be able to be with you here this evening and to say just a, word, a few words uh, to you. I have known FTMS since its start, at a time when the very notion of a private organization offering university-level education was anathema to most people. It was already established that Private 
companies would offer professional training, but not uh, degree level training. FTMS was a pioneer. What was unusual and remarkable in those days is much more standard practice today. FTMS continues to be a pioneering body, and indeed every organisation needs to renew itself constantly. I think you will have noticed that there has been a theme um, running through the proceedings so far this evening, which is to do with the energetic leadership that FTMS has benefited from. Baba Singh Manget has three loves. His family, football, and FTMS. It must uh, be a matter of some curiosity to his family uh, which he puts first. He seems to manage to give them all a very good fist. I'm full of admiration for the leadership that Balbir has given to FTMS, his loyalty to his staff, which has been reciprocated by their loyalty to FTMS and to Balbir. We have already heard that Balbir and his board have steered FTMS through several difficult times, and FTMS is all the stronger for that. Balbir is very hands-on, as you would have realised. He seems to travel endlessly. I think he is the best known passenger at Changi Airport and in KL. FTMS, of course, is all over the place now, I think with about 15 campuses right across this region, but also elsewhere as well. Saying something for a moment to do with the professions to which we belong, I was very struck by a book written by a US professor called John Coffey, um, which was called The Gatekeepers. And it was to do with the global financial crisis. And he identified lawyers, security analysts, credit rating agencies, investment advisors, proxy advisors, and yes, auditors as the gatekeepers who failed to look after the gate uh, when the global financial crisis was brewing. I think accountants and auditors both have quite a lot of blame to take. Accountants uh, for the debacle of international financial reporting standards. The chief executive of Northern Rock our bank, which had a run on it and which failed in 2007, late in 2007, he was quoted in 2005 as saying that IFRS allowed his company to declare faintly insane profits. I won't go into the detail of this because many of you know much more about it than I do, in particular the instructors and the students and the alumni of FTMS. IFRS has replaced the principle of prudence by the principle of neutrality, and that has allowed excessive profits sometimes to be declared, particularly as future expected losses cannot be provided for. And auditors failed to warn. Auditors seem to me to regard themselves as subservient to IFRS, seem to consider that their job was done if they were able to state in their report that the financial statements fairly represented the affairs of the company in accordance with the requirements of the deeply flawed international financial reporting standards. But enough of uh, my serious comments. I'd just like to tell you a story. Some of you will know that the International Standard of Auditing 610 on 
external auditors' reliance on internal auditors has just been revised and reissued. Well, the story concerns three internal auditors and three very senior external auditors, partners in the firm, who were taking a train from Singapore to Kuala Lumpur. Before they began, the audit partners bought three tickets and the internal auditors bought only one. The audit partners were glad that their dumb colleagues were going to get caught and thrown off the train. However, when the conductor was approaching their car, all three internal auditors went to the nearest bathroom and squeezed in. The conductor, noticing that somebody was in the bathroom, knocked on the door. A hand came out with a ticket. He punched it, and the internal auditors saved two-thirds of the ticket price. Now, of course, FTMS alumni would not have behaved like that. Well, on the return trip, the three very senior audit partners decided to use the same strategy. They purchased only one ticket, but the internal auditors did not buy any tickets at all. When the conductor came by, the three very senior audit partners all jammed into the bathroom. And when they heard a knock on the door, they handed out the ticket. They did not get it back. The internal auditors took it and went into the other bathroom. Now that's the real reason why external auditors have trouble relying on internal audit work. They were burned a very long time ago and they have never forgotten. FTMS does not just train accountants and auditors, it has a much wider professional brief than that. Professionals in general should never subordinate their judgment to that of others. Professionals should put service above financial reward. I can remember in the early days as a university academic, when we had a student that was marginal, um, and we were trying to work out whether we should allow that student to graduate, we sometimes would say, would we welcome the fact that this graduate will be an ambassador for our university from this day forward, burnishing or otherwise the image of the institution. And that's really, I think, what FTMS wants to achieve from each of their alumni, that they are proud of the contribution that the alumni make and their ethical standards. Just to finish with two further quotations, character is a quality that embodies many important traits such as integrity, courage, perseverance, confidence, and wisdom. Unlike your fingerprints that you are born with and can't change, character is something that you create within yourself and must take responsibility for changing. And then a quote from John Ruskin, the highest reward for any man's toil, and he might have said any, woman's toil as well is not what he gets for it, but what he becomes by it. I would like to thank the team who planned this event quite obviously and so well, and I would like to wish you all a very good evening's dinner and company together. Thank you for your time. Thank you very much, Dr. Bessemana. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, the next item on my program is says, dinner will now be served. Yes, indeed, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to be good food for you. Please enjoy your dinner. Bon appetit, and we will come back at all with our tonight's program. Enjoy your dinner.
अच्छी है मैं ठीकने लगा था पानी की बोतल हेलो नो ड्रिंकिंग
winners. You are known as the winners. Which means those of you on my left, you'll be known as the... One loser. No, no. Those of you on my left will be known as the champions. Ah, well, what is this for? Because when we have fun, we play games, you fight for points. At the end of the evening, we want to see whether winners has the highest score or champion has the highest score. Let me show you how. Very simple. Tonight is a very special celebration. Show me that you're very happy. I start with the winners. Only the winners. I give away my first 200 points. Show me that you're very happy. At the count of three, I want you to clap and cheer and shout as loud as possible. The louder side wins the 200 points, all right? Winners, if you're ready, at the count of three, one, two, three, go! Oh, okay, not too bad, not too bad. Okay. Champion, show them you can do better. One, two, three, go! Here, the first 200 points goes to the champions! Ah, perhaps first time, winners, you're a little bit shy, not warm up yet, I give you one more chance. Now I will bring up the points, 300 points. One more time from the champions, if you're ready, one, two, three, go! Bring up the chat in the center. Uh, as you see, FTMS Global, they are all over the world, okay, with their many different centers. So, right now, I will do this uh, quick game here. I will play music of different countries. If you can identify the country, first person to run up here, sit on